what's good everybody so if you clicked on this video this is the long awaited um bedroom tour i redid bailey's bedroom and it's finally finally Done. not like completely completely like there's a few like minor things like very simple things that I would like to get but for the overall um the room is completely done like completely completely done and so I'm about to get into the tour um before we get into the tour just a few things one this took a really really long time you guys i've been talking about redoing her room for months literally since last year like i've been working on this room and it's already june it's literally june the second week of june at that so i've been working on this room for a long long time and it's finally pretty much done like yeah so let's get into this tour y'all first walk into the room you'll see bailey's bed is very centered it is very in the center it is a twin bed that i actually got from um ikea i got the bed from ikea even the mattress you guys i purchased from ikea because uh, it's like these thinner mattresses because this actually pulls out and turns into a queen size bed you guys i'm actually going to try to link this actual bed down in the description box for you guys so you guys can check it out so with the bedding bailey loves pink she is super super girly so i was like okay she needs to have something that is bailey if that makes sense you guys <laughs> something that just says Bailey she loves pink she loves girliness and so I saw this comforter that they had at Target I actually have the lavender color for you know my size and I was like my baby needs this comforter so this comforter is actually from Target it was about $40 the sheets as well are from Target and I want to say they might have been about twenty dollars for the twin size i don't remember but i'm definitely going to try to link as much down in the description box as description box as possible and so of course you have her teddy which she loves and she has a stuffed unicorn right here and it literally stays right there at all times um that my sister bought for her it just kind of goes with the room it'd probably be better if it was white or pink but apparently purple was all they had so that's why she has a purple unicorn on her bed so as you can see it's a day bed that's why like this just made sense so her room is very small you guys like very very small so for me i wanted her to have space i wanted her to be able to grow with the well with the bed i wanted her to be able to grow with the furniture so that's why i purchased this particular bed now if you go down here don't mind the sheets go down here she actually has more storage like i said before i wanted her room to have plenty of storage for the simple fact that the room is very small so i was just trying to work with what we had so these drawers actually do open like that i'm not gonna open them all because <laughs> yeah but i'm going to try to open and show you guys how it turns into a um a day bed like a queen size bed let me try okay you guys bear with me because me and my little brother actually put this bed together so it's not put together professionally it's still put together like you can sleep on it in this state it's not difficult at all but i do have some troubles pulling the trumble from under the actual you know twin mattress so let's check let's try to do this Whew. 
Okay, as you guys can see, this is how it turns into a second bed. You know, she had a sleepover or whatever. And as you can see, like the drawers that are underneath here. We don't have anything in here yet, but a. Hey. And like I said, I got the mattresses from Ikea as well so that if she does have a sleepover or whatever, you can take this second mattress and put it up here. So I really liked that it's big enough. Like, say if there is company or whatever, there is space. Okay, so that is the bed portion and how that operates. So next we're gonna go to these pictures on the wall. If you've been following me for a while, you've already seen these particular pictures. These actually came from Burlington Co. Factory months ago, you guys. Months, months, months ago. Um, and I just love the fact that, you know, it's like pinkish purple with the white frames and the gold horse. And then pretty much the same thing. They're not the exact same picture, but I wanted to face them together and put them over the bed to just give it that complimentary, you know, girly atmosphere, girly look. Okay, you guys, I don't know how to get it from being so dark. I wish, maybe because it's the windows, but so pretty much this is what the curtain situation is looking like i got the curtain rod from burlington as well you probably can't really tell but there is like um they're like uh it's a bb curtain rod so it's kind of like a glittery let me see if i can show you guys like a really glittery kind of curtain and so the sheer Curtains actually came from Burlington as well. Let's see if we can get a better look this way. Yeah, these are a sheer pink, and these came from Burlington. And then we have the blackout curtains that are also pink, a little darker pink. Um, and they're blackout curtains. These actually came from Ross. So we have that. There's a very large window in this room. All the windows are really large I really don't know why but that's kind of just what we're working with and so we have Bailey's toys this has a lot of toys a lot of toys so that's pretty much the whole theme is to make space I didn't want to have to just like deprive her of <laughs> her her belongings because it just didn't fit right so we made it work while we have this space and just some of her toys over there that's why the bed is very centered so it doesn't have to be up against the window and it doesn't have to be up against the closet then we just have some pictures right up there one says good vibes then another one says joy those pictures actually came from my room when I had my computer and everything in my room I uh, had this over it and you guys don't mind the walls right now because I'm supposed to be getting this place painted um, sometime this month we move on to the shelving area I just put a picture of me and Bailey this actual picture was in the JCPenney's website it was actually in all the JCPenney's that was like two years ago actually but yeah so I put a picture of her and her dad when she was a newborn. And then this picture oh. Bailey actually <laughs> made. Um, we had a painting night and that's what she painted. So then just some beach seashells that my mom got her when Bailey was a little baby. And these are from the actual beach. And then we have a picture of Bailey as a little baby. And this is on the top. So this is an eight cube shelf that came from Ikea. It's white. Um, I put together myself, of course, per usual, right? So we just have another picture of Bailey and her sister playing. Um, I didn't want to fill all of the cubbies up because I didn't want it to look cluttered i wanted to look you know like it has storage she has space very light very girly that was pretty much the theme of what i was going with 
<laughs> so we also have a lot of Bailey has a lot of books you guys <laughs> she has a lot of books um, I love to read to her she loves to be read to and so she just has a lot of books I have these bees right here that I actually purchased when she was a baby like when I was still living at home with my parents I remember purchasing this because I wanted her to have like a book area um, yes yeah, so I got two of those and then just more toys more books with the bee then we have I don't know if you guys haven't noticed but there is no dresser in this room <laughs> no dresser so we had to make it work right so like i said i didn't want to put anything in each one that's why some of these are empty but i got this cubby a cube cubby thing this actually came from target and this just holds like all her non-jean bottoms so anything that she owns that she can wear as a bottom but are not jeans it goes in this white bin and then skip one and then we have this pink bin that has you know like pretty much her underwear drawer and then i did like all her little her barbie helicopter barbie car barbie cash register <laughs> barbie head um and just some extra stuff at the bottom then she has this one which has all her jean bottoms so jean shorts jean pants anything that's jean related would be in there and this of course is Bailey's little TV just a 32 inch nothing serious just a Roo crew so it has a bunch of apps that she has learned to use on her own thankfully we have a Google Dot that she got from her dad for Christmas and I just keep it up there I don't keep it plugged in but I do just keep it up there um, then we have this lamp you guys I love this lamp like it just went perfectly with the room I love the fact that it's like a diamond like this like the pink shade I know it's like really bright right now but it's actually a, a pink shade and this is also what I loved is that it has this so if she was to try to turn it on she can that aspect of this I really really do love because you know most of the time it's underneath here and yeah I didn't so this actually came from Target the kids section um, on this wall we have her initials you know B for Bailey don't worry about the rest and if you see the signatures those are actually from the baby shower everybody who came to the baby shower instead of having a guest book we in decided to have people sign the letters that would eventually go in her room and here they are come to the other side of the room and this is Bailey's closet like I said we had to make do with what we had with the space so don't mind the closet but this is her toy box right here you guys my mom actually purchased this off of Amazon I'm gonna see if she can send me the link that you know send me the link to it because let me show you I love the fact that it opens like that so say you had a mud room it could also work as you know just regular storage and this could be a bench so I really do like that and it's super super easy to put together and this would just be her clothes you guys <laughs> I'm still working I want to get some storage bins for all the blankets up there for her um, I only buy wooden hangers because she is my mini me I only have wooden hangers so I want her to only have wooden hangers and I got these from Ikea many many years ago you guys so I keep her dresses all up here and then I try to keep for the most part all her jackets down here and all her shirts are over here I also placed a mirror because again she is my mini me she wants to do everything like mommy and she wanted a mirror to check her stuff out <laughs> in the morning so I definitely had to do that this is just a mirror I got from Walmart yeah I got from Walmart and I put the little um, what is that stuff called velcro 
I think it's called Velcro. Um, and I just put it on the back of the mirror and put it on the door and stuck it there. And it's been holding up really nicely for quite a while. So, hey, I definitely recommend that. Okay, sorry if the lighting keeps changing, but yeah. So, then we move to Bailey's little Elsa makeup desk. Then she has like just more toys you guys sis has a lot of toys so that's why like i said before i just wanted to make as much room as possible that she could actually play have a good time but it also was aesthetically pleasing to the eye all right and then behind this door is the bathroom i still am not completely done in here but this is just a little glance at her bathroom. Nothing special. She really hardly uses it, to be honest with you guys. <laughs> but it's hers, right? So I just put a picture of her. She was like nine months. I put a picture right there. And then my first ultrasound with her. Um, yeah, I put right here. She hardly uses this restroom. If anything, she's more in my restroom. Um, she does take baths in here, but for the most part, she used in my bathroom. Then I taped her affirmations up here, you guys. Um, just what she says in the morning and her prayer that she does in the morning. And she also has one taped in my bathroom. Because like I said, she mainly uses my bathroom. <laughs> and we just have like a little sign up here. She might be little, but she is fierce or something like that and then this as well um i got this one and that one i want to say from hobby lobby before she was even born yeah definitely hobby lobby so years 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 ago and then we just have a regular shower curtain that actually came from labria every time labria moves she changes her shower curtain so it's pink, it's Bailey's favorite color, so we got it. So that is the room tour. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Um, like I said in previous vlogs, previous videos, I definitely am going to be redoing this whole entire apartment. I just started with Bailey's room because I feel like it's never really been done. So go ahead and make sure you comment, like, and subscribe because there's going to be more decorative videos, redoing, remodeling, all of that fun stuff. You guys stay blessed. You guys stay encouraged and stay in the word, honey.